Hi and welcome back to freesciencelessons.co.uk. By the end of this video you should be able to describe how a moving coil loudspeaker and headphones work, and this is for higher tier students only. In the last two videos we saw that when a conductor such as a wire is carrying a current, it experiences a force in a magnetic field, and scientists call this the motor effect. We saw how the motor effect is used in the electric motor. In this video, we're looking at how the motor effect is used in loudspeakers and headphones. I'm showing you here a moving coil loudspeaker. We find these in the speakers on a stereo. Headphones contain a similar setup, only much smaller. You need to be able to describe how this works. So we've got a cone which has a coil of wire wrapped around one end. The coil of wire is connected to an alternating current electrical supply. We've also got a permanent magnet which goes inside the coil of wire. As the current passes through the coil, it generates a magnetic field. The magnetic field from the coil now interacts with the magnetic field from the permanent magnet. In other words, these magnetic fields either attract or repel each other. This produces a resultant force which causes the cone to move. When the current switches direction, the direction of the force on the cone reverses. So this causes the cone to move in and out, generating sound waves. By changing the frequency of the AC supply, we can change the frequency that the cone vibrates. A higher frequency will produce a higher pitch sound, and a lower frequency will produce a lower pitch sound. If we increase the size of the current, then we increase the amplitude of the vibration, and this increases the volume of the sound. Remember, you'll find plenty of questions on the moving coil loudspeaker in my revision workbook, and you can get that by clicking on the link above.